Hi, I'm Claudia and today we'll see an overview of our Copy interface. You can search for our Copy app from the store of your device and the app works on Android, iOS or Windows devices, both for smartphone or tablet. You just go to the store, search for ID Survey and download the app for free. Let's see how it works now. When the interviewer enters the app, uh, he can see the list of all the works that are downloaded into the device uh, or he can also add a new work clicking on the plus and then inserting all the data. Now, if I tap into the uh, title of the work of the survey, I can enter it after I've inserted my username and password. That's the main page of the CAP Interviewer app. I can start an interview tapping on the green button. As you can see, I can complete my questionnaire, just answering to any, all the questions that I've created into the admin interface. And in any moment, I can tap on the stop button and I can either suspend or um, mark this interview as a refusal. If I suspend the interview, that means that um, the interview is on hold, so I can restore that interview in a second moment from the moment where it stopped in any any minute, basically. And uh, if I click on refusal, I can insert the reason why the uh, respondent refused to complete the interview. For example, I had to go. And this interview will be marked as refused. If I tap on contacts, I can see the list of all the contacts associated to this survey. If I inserted a list of specific contacts, I can also search through the list for a specific name and surname. Or if I click into the gear wheel button I have on uh, top right, I can see uh, all the different outcomes for each contact. So for example, if I click into the uh, pause button, I can see the contacts that um, has the um, suspended interview. So if I tap into one of my contacts, I can restore the interview and start back from where I stopped and go on with that. In Capi questionnaires, I can also save the GPS position of my interviewers or I can insert questions where I basically ask the interviewer to take a photo of the place we're in. At the end of the questionnaire, I can confirm all my answers. And I will go back to the um, main page. Now, when the uh, interview is completed, uh, the interviewer cannot um, edit the answer saved. Um, that's the standard feature. Obviously, the administrator can uh, give the authorization to the interviewer to change uh, the um, also the completed interview with a specific uh, password. Um, now, usually the system can work both offline and online. So uh, if the interviewer uh, worked offline at the end of the day of when he um, has an internet connection, he can synchronize the data with the admin interface. So, so to do that, uh, obviously he will need the internet connection and he just had to tab on the synchronize button. As you can see, now the synchronization successfully is completed. That's all for our face-to-face -face overview. If you want to see more on telephone and web and admin interface, you can click on our channel and see the other videos. Thanks for watching. Bye.